today i'm letting these world cup trading card packs decide my fifa team now let's find out who our first player is sad al sheep i have literally never heard of this guy but it's not my decision who goes into our team it's up to this wheel every single slice on this wheel contains a different type of criteria that i need to meet when taking a player out of this pile so let's say it lands on bald i can only take a player from this pile that has invisible hair so let's spin the wheel and find out what type of player we're allowed to take i'm hoping we start off with highest rated i want a good player and of course it's gonna be bald just as our example the player we need to pick has no hair al sheep has hair we can't take him barella has hair isaac has hair where wait is that bald matthew hope has beautiful hair ederson no he's not bald but that would be a good player to have nandez has hair where are the bald players kovacic has hair casemiro has hair Ooh! Did I really get a special Harry Maguire card? Giovanni Reyna. And the final card. Oh! I'm saying that's bald. Conte's the first player on our team. Let's go buy him. Now, it breaks my heart to see Conte smile because he's not going to the World Cup due to injury. And in addition, he has no special cards yet in FIFA 23. So we're just going to use his gold rare card. Boom! Now, as Conte's bald head was the first characteristic for our team, let's find out what the second one is. All right, here we go. Slowing down. Worst tattoo. Is it going to stop there? First player is Kimi. Does he have any tattoos? No. Pineda. He does have tattoos. He's one of the players we'll check out. Gales. He doesn't look like he has tattoos. Pepe. No tattoos on his arms. No tattoos. Where are the tattoos? Lakonga. Does he have tattoos? No, he doesn't. Oh, we have one. Incapie. I said that so wrong. Okay, that's another one. He doesn't have tattoos. Last one. Who is this? Pitch Masters. Luka Modric. This is a cool card, but he has no tattoos. I feel like his sleeve isn't that good. We're going to go with Incapie. We're going to add him into the team. This guy must be using whitening strips every second of the day because look how bright his teeth are get into my team now we're two players in but we only have eight packs left as this hobby box came with only 10 packs but one of these packs contains an autographed card which could be worth thousands of dollars so no matter what the wheel says the autographed card goes straight into our team wheel 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 what is gonna be next i have icon on here but i'm scared that we're not actually gonna get an i okay so it's not icon shortest so what i have to do is guess the shortest player in this group of players let's hopefully in all messies in this one because that is a short kick King I would want in my team. First player is Casedo. He looks tall. We're not going to take him. Harry Kane for sure tall. Odegaard. Ah! He's probably pretty tall. Macias looks pretty short. We're going to put him aside. Beckham, he's definitely going into the tall section. Marquinhos is tall. Schlager, no, he looks tall as well. We have Thibaut Courtois. How many keepers are in this pack? Wait, special card. Ronaldo. Paulinha. No, does he look short? Kind of short. Wait, we'll put him aside. Who is this? Roberto Alverdo. He's also kind of looking short. And we got Newhouse. And the final card is Roberto Firmino. Oh, no. Is he short? He's not that short. Out of our choices, we have Macias, Paulinho and Alvarado. Wait, Alvarado isn't even in FIFA? Oh my days, man. All right, let's check Paulinho next. Now, looking at his card, I feel like he's gonna be pretty tall. 6'3"? How did I think this guy was short? This guy's taller than me. Now, we can't even use Macias in our team because he's not in the game. This is Juan Macias, who is someone else, and he's not even in the game either, so we can't even use a guy with the same last name. So instead, we're just gonna put Paulinho in because of my mistake. I literally can't believe I didn't know he was 6'3". He does have a pretty nice team of the week card, so we're just gonna pick this one up. It's not too expensive. Get into my team. I'm hoping we get some crazy card in this one. I'd love to get Mbappe into the team. Paulist. Paulist might work for this. Erling Holland. He's definitely going to be the tallest unless there's keepers in here. Okay, we'll put that one to the side. Quarta, you're not tall enough for me. Miguel, not tall enough. Rasparodi, no, he's not tall. Joe Rogan, no. Jao Felix, no. Menya, no. Oh, Simon, we're going to have to put him to the side. Is he taller than Holland? Mina, he's tall too. Summer, no, Summer's not that tall. Ivan Nusec. No, he's not tall enough. Puhach, my Polish boy, but he's not tall. Richarlison, not taller than Holland. Adeyemi. It's actually crazy that he's going to the World Cup. Good for him. And the final player, what is this? Christian. Who? No, it doesn't matter. Mina is 6'5". No. And he's got 37 pace. Okay, wait. We got to check Simon before we check Holland. 6'3". Is Holland going to be 6'4 or 6'5"? 6'5". He's 6'5". We're using Erling Holland. This is perfect. I did not want Mina in my team. I'm getting so excited to use this Holland card but it's so sad that he's not going to be at the world cup now as these are road to the world cup final packs players like holland are in it even though norway didn't qualify but i still want to use this card so i'm happy about it now i'm not just building this team for fun once i complete every single position in this team what we're gonna do is go into a division rivals game and whichever player has the lowest rating i'm gonna cut up maybe captain is it gonna be captain it's gonna be biggest smile wait yes it's gonna be biggest smile all right unfortunately conte's not in here because he'd automatically win 
playing. They're Paul. No smile on the boy, though. No smile again. Why are these guys not happy when they're playing football? Is that a smile? Aaron Ramsey? No, that's not a smile. That's not a smile either. Hey, what? what is that? Give me a smile. Oh, my days. Wilmer, smile a little. Kanji, not smiling. Vardio, not smiling. Not smiling. Is that a smile? Is that Neymar? He's smiling a little, right? What, why is it backwards? <gasps> oh! Oh, my God! I gotta sign Neymar guard! I can't touch it! I can't... We're adding Neymar into the team, but I'm not even done with the pack. I don't even remember what the criteria was. Everything has flown out of my head. It was biggest smile. Our next card, of course, is Lionel Messi. I'm gonna take that as a smile. All right, so we're adding Messi and Neymar into this team. So for Messi's card, we're gonna use his player of the month. This card has been so good for me. And for Neymar, he only has one other card than his gold card, which is his inform card. So we're gonna pick that one up. I'm very excited to use it. One million! This guy is expensive. Get in my team. So I just checked the box and it says there's one auto autograph per box on average that means there's a chance that we get another autograph in here let's find out what the wheel is gonna make us pick i'm feeling is it gonna be icon is we haven't seen one icon yet in these packs this might be an issue do these even have older players first card di lorenzo not an icon not an icon no icon where are the icons Boyle, reyna richarlison who are these players danny ward not a legend not an icon. Linus, that's a nice card. Not an icon. Jimenez, not an icon. Gunduan, he might be our icon. Sanchez. I think we can all agree out of all these cards, Gunduan would be a potential icon in FIFA. So let's go get him. We're going to play him as a striker. Even off chem, I feel like he'll be good enough. Four packs left. Four categories left. What's it going to be, Wheel? It's going to be captain. Now, from this pack, we need to take a player with the captain's armband on. So, we got Benzema. No armband. Frederick, no armband. No armband here. Oh! Does he have the armband on, too? We're using Cristiano Ronaldo. Now, to get Ronaldo into this team, I have shifted some things around here. We got Neymar on the left mid position. We got Guntawan on the right mid. And now, we're adding Ronaldo as a striker. What a beautiful man. This team is so good. I don't want to cut up any of these cards. Out of these three packs, this one feels pretty good. So, we're going to use this one next. What is going to be our card, though? Long hair. Calvin Phillips. He does have long hair. He does go to the side here. Otero, no long hair. Linus does have long hair. We'll put him aside. No long hair. Is that long hair? No, just bad hairline. Okay. Akanji again. No long hair. And finally, who is this? Montage. Who is this? Peru? Galesi. He is a keeper. He does have long hair. It's the, it's a sign. Fingers crossed he's in the game. I have not seen him before. Pedro, is this him? Yes! He plays for Orlando City in the MLS. Saves with feet. Perfect. This is the guy we need. Get in there. We're down to our last two packs. What's the wheel gonna choose for us? Lowest rated. This one's gonna be tough. We're going by their FIFA rating. I gotta take the lowest rated one. I'm still hoping for another autograph in one of these. Alvarado. This guy again? Pulisic is definitely up in the higher ratings. No idea who these are. Martinez is higher rated. Neymar again. We already have him. Vina might be low rated. Malin's pretty high rated. Pedri's high rated. Lukaku high rating. Sutar might not. No idea who this guy is. Out of that pack, I feel like these two guys are probably lowest rated. So we're going to go off of this. We got the Australian and we got the Chilean. Harry. Of course, Harry Maguire, Harry Sutar. Is he a center back? He is a center back. Oh my days. 39 pace. Red, red. And Diaz, 75 rated. Was he a center back? He's a striker. Okay, we chose the right one. Let's get Harry Australian Maguire into this team. Now, the last position on this team is center back. And according to the wheel, it's highest rated from this next pack. Let's find out who it is. Hulusevsky, that's pretty cool. We got Zielinski, Hugo Lloris, David Raum. Who's going to be the highest rated? It's probably Lloris right now. Vinny! This one would be so good earlier, but he's not the highest rated here. Lloris is higher. Cavani. French. Rabio. Oh my days. We got to play Lloris as a center back. Now the team is complete. Loris is one of our center backs. This is going to be very, very bad. And I have the scissors ready because the player with the lowest match rating is getting cut. And an early messy error caused some initial panic. No. And Neymar didn't start off too hot either. Neymar. But surprisingly, things were going well for the defense. Well done, Harry Maguire. I mean, Harry Sutar. But things took a turn for the worse. Oh no, I can't lose this game. However, Holland quickly equalized. What a mistake. Chip. All right, we're good. Holland is not getting cut up, but our keeper just couldn't make a save. Oh, my days. I feel like our keeper is going to get uh, cut up. Half time. Let's see our match ratings for our players. 5.1, Galise, the goalkeeper. We got to make some saves, Galise. But Neymar picked it up in the second half. That's big. That's big from Neymar right there. And he even got on the score sheet. Yes, Neymar. We're not cutting up Neymar. That's a beautiful goal by him. And another one sealed the deal. Travella. Oh, what a goal. 
to win the game. But who do we have to cut off? I'm actually pretty terrified right now. It's not going to be Neymar. Neymar probably has the highest rating. Holland is 8.7. Neymar 7.9. Our lowest one is our keeper. We got to cut him up. Pedro, it's nothing personal. It's just got to get done. Ah! Now, if you enjoyed this video, you'll enjoy this video right here.